do aim to please here mm -hmm. at NBC 33, and Mark in the Morning is also doing that this morning. That's right. One of our NBC uh, News Today viewers suggested going behind the scenes here at the station. So he is doing that. Let's check in with NBC 33's Mark in the Morning. He's live here in the studio with us, about 30 feet away from us. Mark, <laughs> are you going to keep your distance, or what should we expect oh, here? Oh, you just, well, you can expect anything this morning. Let me put it that way. I do have a restraining order. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm glad you told me. Uh, uh, you're kind of embarrassed to be uh, arrested here on the air. No, Vicki is too cute. That's our email address. Send us this uh, request to go behind the scenes at NBC33. Thank you so much for watching, and thanks for the idea at NBC33.com. We always open your ideas, uh, are welcome to your ideas, and of course, I respond to every single one of them. Now, let's get started right off the bat here. In this newsroom, and by the way, NBC33 signed on the air in 1953. We are the oldest television station in Fort Wayne and Allen County. And I have free donuts, by the way, for folks who stop by. Aren't those delicious? And we have tours on and off the air. So stop by 2633 West State. Now, in the studio here, we have five different sets. You just saw the kitchen set. This is the weather set, which also acts as the weather office. This is where Greg Schaub, John Thonard, and of course Susan Ware all work right here in this little environment. And I think that mess was uh, actually created by Susan Ware. Anyway, over here is the fifth quarter set. Of course, you see Steve Rappaport and Ken Horman do the fifth quarter show from here. Those are actually real uh, scoreboards, and uh, one of our gentlemen on staff, Tad Frank, collects scoreboards. Can you believe it? He had these in his garage, in his family room, and everywhere in his house, and he loaned them to us for fifth quarter. This is the guest set. This is where we do, of course, uh, editor's desk and uh, live at five with the animals and so forth from the Huntington SPCA uh, Humane Shelter. Uh, right here, through the cameras and our camera people, there's our news set. You can see that. Wave, guys. You're, you're live on the air. There you go. Yeah, speed up. Oh, okay. I got to speed up. All right. Thank you. And then, you see, see this big door here? This is actually here for a very important reason, at least it used to be an important reason. They used to do live commercials in the studio. And in there is our prop room. And just outside of that, of course, is the outside. They used to drive cars and trucks in here back in the days when they did live commercials, believe it or not. Just some fun things to know, fun things to tell from Mark in the morning. Much more coming up. We're going to go to production control and news control in the next half hour here on NBC 33 News Today. All right, Mark. It feels a little weird in here with you today, but it's it's all right. Hey, We're are, you, hey, are you sure? Come on. You sure, oh, okay. big, you sure it's all right? I'm in here. Oh. We're just going to have to remember to this clean like, next I'm time. I'm getting vertigo here. <laughs> right. I'll let you get back to your all right. news. we got to get out of here. All right. all right. Thank you, Mark. Okay. Have a good time what goes on behind the scenes at your favorite television station. That's us, by the way. You've come to the right place. <laughs> That's right. NBC 33's Mark in the Morning is giving station tours this morning by viewer request. Yeah, people have been wanting to see this right now, so Mark, give it to them. I will. We're back in news control, and from time to time during newscast, you'll see some of our reporters standing here delivering some very important stories. But this is actually also production control, where they push all the buttons, make everything happen for each and every one of our shows, our newscasts that we put on NBC 33. We're all like family, right? around here. Well, these folks have been here for 20-some years and more, like this lady right here. She's my, one of my favorites. It's Linda McCormick. When are you going to fix breakfast for me, hon? Uh, I was waiting for one of those donuts. Why didn't you throw one up uh, here? Well, we have donuts over on the snack table. I'll show those in just okay. a second. All right, thank you so much. This is Kurt, and he's our director of the show. And Kurt, by the way, is uh, the son of, well, legendary Bob Chase on the radio, Ho Comet Hockey. Uh, um, Broadcaster. Yeah, I've gotten to work with lots of legends. Sportscaster. You, Hilliard Gates, Bob Chase. Yeah. What more can you say? I know. It's great, isn't it? Okay, quit talking. Go to the I next will, guy. but you do a great job. Thanks <laughs> Thank a lot. You. Yeah, he's he's in charge of everything on the show. And we have Jim Abbott. Jim, it's great to Hi, see everybody. you. You followed your dad's footsteps. He worked here for 30-some odd years. Right. And some you're of the here oddest now. years you'll ever see. Yeah, some of the oddest years. And you're wearing his retirement ring, I believe. That's right. Isn't that yeah. nice? It's a 33 right there. Now we can't JJ. That's very nice. Yeah. And he uh, operates Airplay, the big computer that puts all the uh, video on the air, so to speak. Now, the gentleman who writes the show, who gets here at 11.30 every night and works until about 8.30 each morning, but he makes this show possible. He writes it. He gathers all the news. He's our producer. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Robert Tabor. Yes. Hey. Nice to see you. And he uh, dressed up, too. He usually wears T-shirts and blue jeans. Uh, let's go over here. The most important piece of equipment at this area, in this area, is, of course, the production crew snack table. And you can see they have their daily supply of donuts. This is a must. It's in their contracts. We also have some cookies. Uh, there goes Kurt right now, grabbing a donut. And everybody seems to use that table quite often. In here is Mr. Jim Lindley. Now, Jim, 
Jim, you can turn around and wave at us. I'm not going to open the door because we'll get feedback of that awful that sound. But Jim, uh, the man in the window here has been at this television station since we signed on back in 1953. Isn't that right, Jim? Yes, sir. And Jim has worked with us, uh, and this is his first and only job. And he's done audio for many years here at uh, NBC 33. And Jim, we hope you're around for a long time. But when you do finally leave the earth and see the big guy upstairs, we're going to have you stuffed. I'm going to put you right in there on that chair, and this is going to be your little room. You're going to be on display. <laughs> and he wants a donut. All right, here, here you go. Take, take the donuts. There, you, you can just have the whole plate for now. That, well, you want me to take it back? Or you, he's going to keep the whole plate. All right, too much fun. We're all like family here, and we're going to show you. Oh, before we wrap up, last but not least, let's go down the hall and talk to Neil. Neil is in master control. He's the most important and most powerful person at this TV station because his fingers are at the control. He can sign us on and sign us off the air. It's also responsible for all of the uh, school closing calls that we get in here at NBC 33 during the bad weather. So good job, Neil. Nice to see you. Good morning. Very rarely is Neil on TV. I don't think he expected us coming in talking to him this morning. But anyway, next break, in about uh, 30 minutes, we're going to go down the hall, around the corner into the newsroom, and you're going to see my office. That'll be a real treat. It's tour day, NBC 33 News today. I'm Mark in the morning. Down the hall into the newsroom and to see you. That's where the action happens. That's right. Here, Mark. Mm -hmm. Right down, right down here. All right. Right, right in here. Hey. <laughs> get out of here. Hey, nice to see all you guys this morning. We never get to see you on TV. It is 5.53 right now. Susan is back with another look at that forecast. Yep, starting out in the mid-60s today, and we should make it to near 80 degrees. Otherwise, we are looking for a chance of scattered showers and thunderstorms. What you'll notice right now, teen, overnight tonight, partly cloudy skies. will take over, and we get down to an overnight low of about 58 degrees. A little bit back to normal for the rest of the week, huh? Yeah, a little bit. All right, a little bit. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> okay. Well, normally, this is the time when we check in with Mark and the morning but instead right now everybody we're going to have mayhem in the morning because mark in the morning is causing it here in the in the building today he's just running around behind the scenes and mark what you got now uh, wait a minute i wrote a much nicer intro for that oh <laughs> i'm sorry I, I must have edited it on the fly okay all right well uh, really uh, the reason why i'm here in the station this morning is because it was a suggestion from one of our viewers figgy is too cute that's her i think it's a her uh her uh, email address and it says dear mark i think you should give us the viewers a behind the scene look at your news station and so that's what we're doing this morning we've already been in the studio we've been in the uh, master control area and now we're in the newsroom and you notice it's elevated so we can see everything we can see all in the newsroom by golly i'm the king of the newsroom and i'm going to give you a tour of the newsroom coming up in just a few short minutes here on nbc 33 news today by request all right, a lot quieter in there than it is uh, normally in the afternoon, Mark. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's a complete zoo in here, about uh, noon or so. Uh, organized chaos. That's right. We'll see you in a little bit, Mark. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you very much, Susan. See you in a bit. Jewelry 70% off. The Kmart store closing sale. Only at these select locations. At least 20 to 40% off store wide. Welcome back, everybody. 626 on this Wednesday morning. You know that we aim to please every morning, and that's just what NBC 33's Mark in the Morning is doing that's as well. Right. One of our viewers suggested going behind the scenes here at the station today. That's right. Showing a little bit of behind the scenes spirit. hoo -yah, Mark. Yes, I am right here in the newsroom. In fact, uh, it's Figgy is too cute. She wrote me on the NBC33.com webpage <coughs> on the ideas for Mark there, and she says, why don't you show folks around the, the station behind the scenes? What I've done is opened up the station for free tours until seven o'clock just come to 2633 west state boulevard we'll be here i will personally conduct that tour like i am with the rooster how you doing jim jim castle there he has never been to the station at least since the 1960s so i'm showing him around anybody else who comes um the newsroom is actually a lot more active than this during the day about nine o'clock or so everybody comes in all the producers and this is called producers row and usually we have producers everywhere for each one of our newscasts this is becky sandling sandling and she is a uh, she she is our uh, midday producer. What's the lead story right. for midday? Hmm? Hmm? Well, Mark, hmm? it's a little early for hmm? me to tell hmm? you that. You'll have to watch the midday, uh, but it's going to be good. Always on the edge <laughs> of my seat with you. Okay. Now, I want to show you down here. Uh, right down there is uh, Mary Collins' office, of course, uh, on Live at Five. This is Linda Jackson's office. You can see her torch there from the Olympics uh, coverage right there. Yeah, that's very nice. Now, uh, take you down here. This is the news director's office, Kathy Ball, and right next to the news director's office, so she can keep an eye on me, is my office. And we go in, 
And uh, I have a little candle going here. We have a makeup mirror. You can see Big John Yoder for the very first time right there through the counter. And focus in on that, Big John. There's Big John. Yeah, behind the scenes right there. You probably will never get to see that again. Thank you, Big John. But anyway, this is the NBC33.com uh, web page right here. We always have that up in the newsroom. And of course, I have my own little stereo system right here. I uh, wonder what's on. Let's see. I have one thing to say. Oh. You better work. Oh, that's our theme song. We gotta work. Yeah, where's Rooster? Rooster, come on. Come on. We are jamming in the newsroom. And we'll talk to you another half hour or so. You do the chicken dance, Rooster? Oh. Boy, such fun and frivolity going on here in the NBC 33 newsroom. We'll talk to you in another 20 minutes or so. Come on, work it, work it. That's right. Yeah, work it. Sorry. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> that's what it looks like every day back there, folks. Right. <laughs> no big deal.